the process of writing has been dictated by uh, so many other factors other than just getting it done, mainly because I have a day job which is writing and directing an animated film which takes up my entire day and sometimes night because it's for an American studio so the time difference means I'm often on the phone till very very late at night. So my writing regime tended to be from 6 in the morning till about 9.30 and then I'd go to work and then I'd come home and then uh, I normally didn't write in the evenings but I'd kind of read over that morning stuff and then go oh it's terrible and cut out loads of it and then the next morning start again and then all weekend. It was basically just I just had to squeeze it into the times that were available without affecting what I was doing um, during the day. I tend to write in my bedroom because I can justify closing the door and say go away because any other spaces anyone can kind of use and it feels a bit selfish whereas my bedroom I could say you know it's a good reason why you can't come in here right now kids so so that's good and then um, uh, yeah and, and that was I just sit in the bedroom with a, with a cup of tea Lo loads of tea the illustrations for the book were happening at the same time as writing it they all started at the same time. As soon as the monsters were sort of going around, I was st starting to draw them and write notes. The idea was to make sure that the illustrations looked like, ref looked like the ones that I'd been sketching in my sketchbooks. I've got tons of sketchbooks full of these things and for it to feel very informal. But it's actually a, just a pleasure. It's a real joy to just sit down and draw.